In this video, I'm going to teach you how to fix Elden Ring bloated resolution issue on Steam. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. If you are trying to play Elden Ring through Steam and you are encountering errors related to your resolution, it is super simple to fix it. So, all that you have to do is press Windows plus R. This should open up the run window like this. If it doesn't, you can open up the Windows menu and look for the run command. So, in here, type percentage, app data percentage, and press OK. This will redirect you to this folder, app data roaming. In this location, look for the Elden Ring folder. So, you will look for Elden Ring, open it up, and in here you will find a folder or multiple folders with various different IDs, and most importantly, this file, graphicsconfig.xml. What you have to do is open this with Notepad, so you can right-click this and add it in Notepad, or open up an instance of Notepad and then just drag this file inside. Once you are able to edit this file inside of Notepad, what you have to do is look into these lines here. So all of these refer to resolution. As you can see, my main monitor is an ultra-wide, so it is 3440 3, by 1440. Most people will have a full HD monitor, so if that's the case for you, under full screen width, full screen height, or borderless screen width and borderless screen height, input the resolution. So for example, the width would be 1920, so input the width on both of these, and then the height would be 1080. If, for whatever reason, you are playing windowed, be sure to do the exact same thing here. So once again, 1920 on the width and 1080 on the height. With all of this done, remember to save this file. I'm not going to save because I don't have a full, a full HD monitor, but if you do, input 1920 by 1080. And of course, if you have a bigger or smaller monitor, just change it accordingly. Another popular option would be 2560 by 1440. So just input the resolution accordingly, save this file, and you will be good to go. So, I hope I was able to help you. If this video helped you fix your Elden Ring issue, please consider subscribing. As you can see, according to the channel metrics, 83% of the people watching our videos are not subscribed. By subscribing, you can help us make higher quality videos. Thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next one.